Hi everyone, it's been a while since I reviewed something that I bought online and today I'd like to share with you something that took me a while to buy for my YouTube videos, which is actually a microphone system. Uh, what you can see here today, we are reviewing the BY version 2. This is the Lightning version for iOS devices. There's also a USB-C version for Android devices. The reason why I got this Boya microphone is because I used to use a Boya level layer mic before. And the price point for this is not too expensive for my for my trying, hence me getting this one ahead of the DJI mic. Perhaps I'll get that in the future. The reason why I got a mic is because I primarily shoot on my iPhone and shooting at a one to two meter distance can be very difficult is because of the noise that the iPhone mic picks up. It picks up sounds such as background music, people talking, and it's very hard to isolate and edit this noise out during post-production. So for starters, that's why I got the, this mic to try to eliminate all these issues in my uh, YouTube videos. Huh? So besides it being $60, which is a good price point for me for now, uh, it has a good runtime and a good distance as well. So let's see what's in the box. All right, nothing special. Uh, as shown on the box, there's two mics and one receiver. So let's take them out. So the mic looks like this. Uh, this is without the cover. There's a clip, the noise suppression button, and the power button. So there's two, one pair. And then there's the receiver where this goes into your iPhone via Lightning. And then it has a USB-C port for you to charge the phone while it's being plugged in so you don't run out of battery during long recordings, right? Uh, also in the box is actually two cables to charge both mic at the same time. So you're good to go for your next video every time. So let's go and test the sound and see how it sounds like. Hopefully it's good. Okay, this is how I usually shoot my videos on an iPhone on a tripod about one meter distance and this is how I usually sound like without a mic. At times, when it's a bit noisy, you can hear some background noises, uh, especially maybe when I'm shooting indoors, I think it's fine in the house, but when I shoot outdoors, in my previous videos, I tried to isolate the sound because of background music I was playing in the food court and it sounded very uh, difficult. You know? So that's why I was trying to look for a mic and Let's try the Boya and see how I sound with the mic. Alright, this is how I sound with the mic. It took me a while to actually figure out how it really works. It's very simple actually, you just plug it in and then switch it on. When you have static blue, then you're good to go. But the problem is that when you plug it in and you record yourself in between takes, if you want to listen to yourself, you have to unplug it because when you plug it in, I think the audio in and the audio out gets changed. So regardless if you mute it or you try to turn it on the speaker you can't hear yourself but if i'm doing it wrong just let me know in the comments this is the same video setup from my iphone 13 pro at a one meter distance now with the mic in between takes i was listening to myself as i walked away from the camera to see myself in the mirror and i come back the sound is still the same it's much more clearer closer and it's easier to edit okay now we're testing the mic at the high, at High Park where we are looking at the cherry blossom in the rain so currently we are at 1 meter so let's try how far we can go with this mic let's go and we're going and we're going uh, it's raining today it's surprising though there's a lot of people in the park although it's raining I think given that it's not raining Squirrels, dogs, uh, quite a very nice park though. And so sort of fine, but so now I think I'm at the park. There it goes. Okay, bubbling back. Okay, this is the second test we are trying to do. The first one is a bit bad because I was not facing the camera. And then there's a lot of static in it. Uh, we're at so what I'm going to do is uh, walk backwards and see how far this mic can go before it starts to fizz out again. So I believe 
think I'm not going to kill anyone, right? So I'm walking, I'm walking. And I think about here could be a good distance, I guess. That's all for the review today. I know it's a bit short, but I hope it gives you a decent review on reviewing with just your mobile phone or with a mic attached to it. If you guys are using any other mic and you think it's better than this one, do comment below because I look forward to upgrading to a better one in future. If you enjoy this video, hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel for future online purchases review and some of my Living in Canada vlogs. That will be all for today and I'll see you in the next one.